host Erica Santos and you're watching Beauty on a Budget and today we're at Innovation Salon in Albany, New York and we're completely taking it over. They've let me shut it down, all the customers are gone, it's just the hairstylists and the makeup artists here. But we're going to show you guys out there two specific makeup looks and one hairstyle. And we might even introduce who asked for these things and then you'll get a Beauty on a Budget t-shirt later on. So stay tuned. Well, as I said, we're here at Innovation Salon in Albany, New York and the first thing we're going to get started with is our water for our hairstyle and that was sent to us by Dow Nelson's. So we have Maureen Munoz here and she's the owner of Innovation Salon and basically I know she's going to get to it so I want to get started and see how, how nice this is going to look on my hair. I might even rock it for the night. So. Hi Erica. Hello. So basically we're going to be doing the water palm braid and I'm going to be explaining to you guys how to do this. First thing you want to do is you want to make sure that the hair has no tangles in it. So I just use a nice brush. Give it a brush. The other thing that you want to be aware of is where they're going to part it. So if they're going to part it to your left, you're going to start on the left, okay? I usually like to leave a little piece of the bang out if they like on the opposite side of where I start. Well, I think I'll, I, I like that out. So. Okay, that sounds good. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to start our braid as if we're doing a French braid. Oh, well then that means I'm going to have to keep watching this episode over and over again because I can't do a, fresh, a French braid to save my life, so. Yeah, you definitely <laughs> want to do this. Um, it's going to take some practice for you to get used to doing this. And also, um, just keep practicing it. And when you're doing it on yourself, it's even harder. So you're going to get a feel for it as well as, you know, you know seeing it. Yes. So what we're going to do is we're going to section the hair in the front. And we're going to just section it into three sections, okay? And we're just going to cr start crossing over. French braid is when you cross over and you take some hair and you add into what you crossed over, okay? So to get started, I'm just going to start like I'm doing a French braid and then I'm going to work it into the waterfall braid. So I'm going to cross over and I'm going to add some hair. Now, we're going to start our waterfall part. So instead of crossing over the bottom part, we're going to leave it out, actually. And we're going to pick up some hair right behind it and cross that over instead. Top, we're going to cross over and we're going to add just like a French braid. Bottom, we're going to drop out the bottom and pick some hair up underneath. Cross over, add some hair. Bottom, drop out, grab some hair right behind it, cross that over. And you can pull on it to make it a little tighter, randomly. So cross over, add some hair. Drop out the bottom, grab some hair right next to it, cross that over. And now you have three, three strands, so you're just going to braid. Now you can have lots of options here. You can braid it all the way down. You can just braid partially. I'm just going to braid it partially. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pin it. So I have Gina, my assistant, here. When you're pinning, you always want to make sure the short part of the bobby pin is going to catch the hair and the, the long part of the bobby pin is going to actually s sit next to their head. If the short part sits next to the head, it's, it will hurt them. So you want to just make sure that you have the long part sitting next to your head. So you just want to get in there, weave it a little bit, and pin it. I'm going to do one more. So short part of the bobby pin grabs the hair long part of the bobby pin is flat against their head or your head. So basically that is the waterfall braid.
So you just saw Maureen do the fabulous waterfall effect on my hair. And for all you fans out there, she has a little bit of, um, of a goodie for you. So what do you got? Yeah, so we have, if you come in and men mention that you saw the spread on Beauty on a Budget, you can get the spray done at Innovations for $10. Now, don't tell me that that's not a good deal out there for all you fans that are in the 518 area. And if you just come to visit, I think you should come to Innovation Salon anyway. So um, we're going to go on to the next segment, which is basically two makeup looks. So stick around.